Welcome to the start of our first workout. That warm up was hard. I hope you're sweating as much as me and my friends are. We're gonna jump right into it. So if you're at home, find a comfortable place, turn that music up, give yourself some time. We're gonna go ahead and start on our butts. Everyone's gonna sit down. Once you're down, you go ahead and lay down, find a nice comfortable position sideways. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna flex our foot and we're gonna start by working the side of that butt cheek and we're gonna lift our leg up as high as we can. Now before we start, Shay Lynn's the regression. If you can't focus on getting the full movement, start with the baby step, that's okay. Danny's doing the full workout and Sarah's doing the advanced version. We're gonna go ahead and start by lifting our leg in about eight seconds. So about five, four, three, two, and lift. We're gonna lift all the way up, try to find maximum range of motion. Again, don't judge yourself against anyone else. We're taking our time, we're having some fun, and we are breathing the entire time. Lift all the way up, all the way down, and close them off. Here we go. Continue to breathe, continue to find length. Your glutes should be on absolute fire. Now, in five seconds, we're gonna to switch to the bottom part of our leg. In three, two, one. We're gonna take that leg and cross it over. We're gonna straighten that bottom leg out and we're gonna pull from the inside of our thigh. Ready, here we go, go. Lift up, keep the energy up at home and continue to rise as much as you can, fall as much as you can. Breathe and control. Here we go, breathe and control. I need you to fight for 10 more seconds. I need you to fight for 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two. Great job, guys. Go ahead and flip over. Catch your breath at home if you need to. Press pause if you need to, but continue to give yourself the time you need. This is not going to be easy. Making progress isn't easy. We're going to start in five, four, three, two, and here we go. We're going to lift our leg up. Again, you should be feeling a huge burn in those glutes, a huge burn in those glutes. It's not going to be easy. Continue to focus on yourself because it is for yourself. You deserve it. Continue to drive through your glute, drive through your hip. Finish for 10 more seconds. Continue to fight, continue to fight. Keep the energy up. In three, two, one, we're gonna drive that top leg over. Now again, we're gonna work on those really hard to reach inner thigh muscles. Go ahead and pull. Imagine you're driving your leg as hard as you can the entire time. Through the wall, everybody, through the wall. Good, continue to breathe. I know this is real. This is getting real. My people are even starting to burn. It's getting wild. Continue to go, and in three, Two, one, we're gonna go ahead and find a plank. We're gonna go ahead and find a plank. Now again, Shay's gonna to drop to her knees. If you cannot do this at home, that's fine. Go to your knees and you can even elevate your hands if you need to, but don't quit the workout because it's hard. We're gonna go ahead and start up, find length, go. All the way up and I want you to imagine your belly button's getting pushed into your waistline, but you're trying to round your back like a turtle shell as much as you can. Great job, guys, great job. As you can tell, they're starting to shake, starting to burn. Again, that's when the magic is made and the work is actually starting to actually happen. Good, I need you to last for four more seconds. Three, two, one, and rest, good. Now at home, you're gonna feel really winded. You have one more set after this. We're gonna do the same thing again. So now, take time to focus on your breath. Breathe in through your hands, make your stomach really, really fat on the way out, and relax on the way in. Continue to find as much breath as you can, guys. Let your nervous system calm down. This is part of the workout. Performance does mean relaxation and self-care, not just kicking butt the whole day. Good, now we're getting ready to start our second superset. We're gonna run that back one more time with the same energy, but I know you're gonna feel it more than you did the first set. More than we did the first set. We're gonna go ahead and start in seven seconds, the same spot that we did, those abductors. Here we go, in three, two, one, let's lift. Let's rock and roll. Continue to breathe. Continue to find length. If you're at home and you're starting to burn and things are starting to hurt, you're allowed to press pause. But again, don't quit. Recalibrate, get right back at it. Good, continue to breathe. Things should start to burn and fill up with blood. That's a good thing. If you're in pain, it's gonna help. I promise you, continue to fight. In three seconds, we're gonna go ahead and switch to that bottom leg. Go ahead and go. Now again, find length before you lift. Find length before you lift. As you can even see with Sarah right now, there's no knee bend. It's straight as an arrow and we're pulling from the inside of those thighs. I know it's a very hard area for you guys to reach sometimes. That's okay. Good. In three, 
two, one. Go ahead and sit up. We're going to switch sides. Again, take time if you need to, but if you can, continue to press play, continue to keep going. We're going to continue to fight. Good job. Now, here we go. We're going to start in three, two, one. Go. Good job. As you can see, Danny's even pushing through his foot. I want you to imagine there's an arrow from your foot going this way, so you're making sure your quad and glute are flexed all the way through. All the way through. Great job. Good. And four, three, two, here we go. Go ahead and cross that top leg. Now, again, I want you to pull from your hip bones. Very, very hard to do. Very hard movement to do. You will never get these muscles by running. You will never get these muscles by only dieting. You do have to work these muscles out. You have to work them out too. Continue to go, continue to breathe. Good job, guys. Seven, six, five, four, three, Two, now we're going to go ahead and switch to our last plank. You're almost done. These are for those tough to reach ab muscles, but also at the same time, push your feet into the ground and work out your quads. We're going to start in three, two, one, go. You can even see Danny's trying to push to the top part of your back. Don't let this lower back dip. That's going to cause a lot of pain. So imagine pushing through that belly button and holding that right there. Good job, Shay. Good job, Sarah. And good job, you at home. You got 10 seconds. Eight, seven, breathe. Do not hold your breath. Do not hold your breath. Do not hold your breath. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Great job, great first set. We're getting ready to move on to the second set. Now you have 21 seconds down. Next, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go ahead and lay on our back. Let's go ahead and lay on our back, guys. What we're gonna work on is our glutes. I know everyone wants a good pair of glutes and that's okay, don't be ashamed of it. What we're gonna do is we're gonna pull our toes up in our shoes, okay? After we pull our toes up in our shoes, I'm gonna imagine I'm driving my heels through concrete, just like I'm standing on right now. In your brain, imagine driving your feet through four inches of concrete every glute bridge you do. Are we ready to go? Yeah. We're ready to go, okay. Let's lift up, let's drive through our heels, and here we go, three, two, one, let's go. Again, we're tucking that pelvis under ourselves, not getting into that lower back. We're just working the full glute muscle. We can slow it down a little bit and continue to drive. Drive your feet through the ground as hard as you can. 10 more seconds, y'all. 10 more seconds, y'all. Good. Now at home, do not get into your lower back. Don't get into your lower back. Once I stop at the top of my glute, I'm done. Good, and rest. Let's go into a reverse crunch. Let's go into a reverse crunch. Now, as you can see, Shay is going to be doing the regress version. Her butt is not off the ground. She's only going one leg at a time. That's okay. With Danny and Sarah, Danny is going a bent leg. My lower back is driven through the ground like a turtle shell, and I'm going to continue to find length. Very good movement to go right from a glute bridge, too. Now, Sarah, if you're kicking butt already in these workouts, you can go all the way out with those legs, but be careful of your lower back. I never want anyone to get hurt when doing these workouts. Great job, guys. Now, in five seconds, we're going to add a little mobility. Mobility with glutes and abs is a great thing. Now, we're gonna call it a 90-90. So we're gonna go ahead and rest everybody. We're gonna hold those heels. Now again, I'm gonna imagine my body is going the opposite way of my feet. So as my legs go to one side, we're gonna go ahead and go. I'm gonna let my hips stay square. I'm gonna let those knees rock side to side. Take your time. Give yourself 21 seconds to let that heart rate come down. We're gonna work on the lower back, the hip, and everything with mobility. Good job. Good job, good job. Continue to fight. Take your time. You do not have to go fast. Good. In three, two, one. Okay, everybody, go ahead and lay on your back. Let's work on those belly breaths. We got 20 seconds down. Now, if you're at home and you don't know how to breathe, I don't want you breathing through your chest. I want you to calm your nervous system down by breathing through your stomach and your lower back. It's the base of meditation. If we can learn to do that during the workout, it's going to be fun when we actually get a chance to meditate. It's going to be fun. Okay. Are we ready to go glute bridges again, everybody? Yes. Okay, here we go. Now at home, turn the volume up on the second time. Let's have some more fun. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's roll. Good. Continue to pulse. Continue to drive your heels through the ground, guys. This is a fun exercise. The better the glutes are, the better your summer is. That's what I hear. We're going to continue to drive through, continue to have some fun. Good. We have six seconds left. Continue to pump it up. Continue to go at home. Continue to find more range of motion. Continue to find more motivation every single set. Okay, relax. We're gonna to go to our reverse crunch. Right into it, no rest. Now again, Shay, going one leg at a time, that's great. Danny's doing the middle version where we're keeping that lower back. Imagine I'm punching through his stomach and that lower back is grounded so I'm not gonna hurt myself. Sarah's kicking butt on the actual progression here. 
Good job, guys. Eight seconds. Continue to go. I'm telling you, we're working up a great sweat in here. You should be working up a great sweat at home. Do not take it easy on yourself. Continue to push. Good. Now the last set, we're going into 90-90s in three seconds. And go. Now again, as you can see, if I'm with Sarah right here, she's not letting her shoulder follow her legs. She's actually putting weight on the opposite shoulder. So if your legs go right, your shoulders go left and vice versa. Stretch out those hips, those lower back. Really going to continue to work. Good job, everybody. Good job. In three, two, one, rest. Good. Now, we can breathe on our 21 seconds. As we breathe, we're getting ready to go into an upper body set. With these amazing bands that we're giving you guys, I want you to grab both of them right now. We're going to go ahead and sit up. We're going to go ahead and get on our feet again. Once we get on our feet again, it's time to light the world on fire. So what I want you guys to do is I want you to grab a mini band. As you can see, you're just going to put it around your wrist. You don't need to go crazy. You don't need to make sure it's pulling your hair. Just make sure it's around both wrists, nice and tight around our hands. We're going to work a lateral raise. So in five seconds, I want you to have those arms locked, those triceps locked. I want you to focus on the middle of your shoulder. Three, two, one, let's go. We're just pulsing out. We're pulsing out through those shoulders for your favorite dress, your favorite summer shirt, your favorite tank top. You have to understand the shoulder, the bigger it is, the less you have to lose in your waistline, which is a beautiful thing. So we're gonna build our shoulders and work on our core at the same time. Good. And four, three, two, one, drop those bands. I need you to pick up either a, we're gonna have a couple different length of bands. This is the skinny one. We're gonna go ahead and push our arms out, protract to the middle of our back, and we're gonna pull that band apart. Good job. Pull that band all the way apart. 21 seconds of some fun. 21 seconds of fun. We're working those back, not working the traps. I don't want you guys to have big traps. We're working those nice inner back muscles for that open strap breast. Or if we're just wearing out a shirt, nothing on the back. It's good for the back, good for the muscles. Good job, guys. Continue to fight. Now, again, I want you to drop those bands. We have 21 seconds down. This is a time where even when I'm standing, I continue to focus on my breath. Continue to breathe. You can shake it out. You guys having some fun? Oh, yeah. I'm having a lot of fun. Now, again, remember at home, we're with you guys in your living room. You can let us motivate you, or eventually one day, hopefully, we can work out together. So you got eight seconds left. We're getting ready to kick some butt again, guys. We've got to keep this tempo up, keep this energy up. Okay, in three, two, one. Here we go again. Here come the shoulders. Let's go. Go. Continue to breathe. Focus on the triceps. Do not bend your arms. I don't want you guys to have big traps. So stand nice and tall and pulse out. Pulse out. Pulse out. Good job. Eight seconds, guys. Turn it up. Come on, turn it up. Give me a little more energy. Give me a little more energy. Give me a little more energy. In three, two, one. Drop that band. Pick up the next band. No rest. No rest in between. Here we go. Ready? Three, two, one. Go. Continue to breathe, continue to push. You're almost done with this workout. We got one more thing after this, it's some cardio and we're gonna kick some butt. You got nine seconds, give it all you have. Eight, seven, come on guys, more. Six, five, four, three, oh, yeah. two, and rest. Good job, good job, good job, good job, good job. You got 21 seconds down. Now, here's the sweet spot. We're getting ready to go into cardio. We're getting ready to go into cardio, I'm telling you it's gonna get real. It's okay if you need to take a break, take a pause. But again, I need you to finish the entire workout for yourself. I need you to finish the entire workout. Don't stop at one set. Now, we're getting ready to go. We're ready for some uppercuts? Yep. Make sure we're squashing the bug. Three, two, one, let's go. We're getting uppercuts going. Get that energy going, get that foot going. We're uppercutting the world all the way up. Continue to go, continue to breathe. I need to hear you guys exhale and breathe. Exhale and breathe. Come on. You see how Danny's match crunching between his feet? It means he's rotating. It's a good thing now in three, two, one, in and out. Go. Let's go. In and out. In and out. Now, again, as you can see, Shay is not jumping. If you have a back pain at home, she's taking her time and stepping out at the range of motion she's going. We're kicking some butt over here, and that's okay. You need to do the version that's going to help you the most. All right. In three, two, one. We're going scissor jumps. Let's go. Turn and burn. Forward and back. Push those arms out. Push those arms out as hard as you can. You have to continue to go with the cardio. Faster and harder. Faster and harder. Here we go. Come on. Three. Keep it going. Continue to breathe, continue to breathe, continue to push out as hard as you can at home. Continue to push, we're almost done. You get a rest time in three, two, one. Let's take a rest, 21 seconds down. Man, that was incredible. That was amazing, that was amazing. We got another two rounds. Stay with us, stay with us. 
We only got 13 seconds left. That 21 seconds goes by fast, guys, but only 21 minutes a day. You deserve it to yourself. Are we ready for round two? Oh, yeah. Okay. Come on. I'm telling you, it's about to get real. Here we go. In three, two, one. We're going uppercuts. Here we go. Continue to push. This is the hardest part of the workout, guys. The hardest part of the workout and what you need to go the hardest at for yourself. For yourself, continue to breathe. Continue to breathe. I'm telling you, these people are dying here. Rotate the back foot and continue to exhale. Continue to exhale. We're almost done. Good job, guys. In three, two, one. In and outs. Here we go. In and outs. In and out. Now again, watch Shay. If you only have to squat a little bit, that's better than not squatting at all, right? So even if it steps in and out, this is great. This is great right here if you can only step in and out. No worries. Eight seconds more. Eight seconds more. Oh yeah, let's go. Here we go. We're almost done. We're almost done. Three, on, two, one. Scissor jumps. Let's go finish, guys. Here we go. Punch it out. Punch it out. All your aggression, everything you have, you're allowed to push forward through the wall. You're allowed to push forward through the wall and continue to go. Good job, continue to breathe. Continue to breathe, come on everybody. Come on everybody, you deserve it at home. Good job Shay, good job Danny, good job Sarah, and good job you at home. Continue to go, continue to go, come on. In three, two, one, let's rest. Wow, wow, I'm telling you. We're, oh, hey, one more round, give me one more round, we're gonna do some recovery breath work, then you can turn this off and go enjoy a beautiful day. Continue to go, here we go. Eight seconds left. I know you guys are hard stumping. I'm lucky I'm not the one doing this full workout, I'm telling you that much. We ready to go? Last round. Three, Good. two, one. Uppercuts. Here we go. Last one. Finish strong. This is what you deserve yourself for. Hopefully it's early in the morning or late at night when no one else is paying attention to you, when you have to do all the work for yourself. No one has to see this. Continue to go. Commit to this. Commit to finishing the workout. You made it this far. If you press pause, I'm going to be so upset at you. I'm going to be so mad. You were so close to finishing. So close. Here we go. Switch. In and out. Let's go. Oh. It's okay. You're allowed to mess up. You're allowed to mess up. You're allowed to make mistakes. Just finish the workout. Finish the workout. Good. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Eight, seven, six. Good job, Shay. Keep going. Three, two, and one. Last one. Scissor jumps. Go. Get the heart rate up all the way through, guys. Everyone counts in this group. Push out all the way. Let everything go. If you have some anger or aggression, push it out. Push it out, Shay, as hard as you can. Continue to go at home. Continue to go at home and finish the process. Three, two, one. Oh my gosh, we did the whole workout. Let's go. Let's go, everybody. Let's go. I get a high five. You get a high five. You get a high five. Here we go. Now at home, you get a high five up top. So what I want to do, you deserve this. This is the hardest part of the workout because it's only mental. What I want you to do is find that split squat stance that we started with. That left leg is up. You don't have to go low. You can stay right here, and I want you to continue to breathe through your stomach and your lower back. <sighs> continue to breathe through your stomach and your lower back. We are calming our nervous system all the way back down, and we are starting to be able to find our breath again. You're allowed to stretch. You're allowed to move your neck left and right. We're breathing. Now, again, we're working on our mindset. We're working on our approach to our breath, which is more important and being stressed is actually finding a position where you can stress the body, but also work on the breath. We've got another 20 seconds of this, another 20 seconds. Good, let those shoulders relax. Let those hands relax, let your face relax. Everything should be getting heavy. The sweat should be dropping on the ground. That's not a bad thing. Good, continue to breathe. Breathe stomach. So I should be able to see their stomachs moving through. If you're at home, do not, don't hide anything. Let this go, let all the tension go and breathe. Continue to breathe. 10, nine, don't hold your breath, Shay. We gotta breathe. Good job. Five, four, three, two, and stand up. Good. 10 seconds down. We're gonna go ahead and breathe. We have the other leg and then you're done for the day. You did the first workout. You did the hardest thing, which is to take the first step. You take the first step, the second, third, and fourth workout. It's a breeze, I promise. Here we go. We're ready to go. Last thing you guys have and go. Now again, Shay, I want you to stand a little taller and put your back leg a little closer to your front foot, even taller, just in case you can't get to this position, even taller, even taller, right there. So again, if you can't get all the way down, this is okay. It's stretching the calf, we're getting some glute work again, but again, this is to calm your nervous system down. As you can do, get better and better, we can explore deeper and deeper and deeper ranges of motion. Now again, 
This does not mean this workout is easier for her than it is for him. You have to start at a point and you're allowed to work from point A to point B to point C. Continue to give yourself time. 20 more seconds and you're done. Breathe. Good. Good job. Good breath. Good breath. Find a point on the wall. You have 10 seconds and we're done. Hopefully this is the best workout of your entire life. They're only going to get better and rest. Good job, day one. Good job, everybody. Good job at home.